In this tutorial, I will solve a numerical in which we have to find the center of gravity of a uniform lamina which is a composite section. So before starting our today's tutorial, if you didn't subscribe my YouTube channel Civil Tutor, please subscribe it and don't forget to press the bell icon so that you don't miss any updates in future. Now let's start with our today's tutorial. Whenever we need to find the center of gravity of a composite section, we divide the section into a number of areas. Similarly, we will divide this lamina into three areas, area 1, area 2 and area 3. In which area 1 is a rectangular shape having dimensions 12 cm into 6 cm. Area 2 is a semicircle having a radius of 3 cm and a diameter of 6 cm. While as area 3 is a triangular shape having a base of 6 cm and height 6 cm. Now let's choose a reference axis for calculation of y bar. So we will choose the bottom line AB as reference axis for calculation of y bar. Whereas y bar is the distance of centroid of this whole lamina from the bottom line AB. Now A1 is the area of this rectangle which is equal to 12 cm into 6 cm equal to 72 cm square. And let Y1 be the centroidal distance of this rectangle from the bottom line AB. As we know the rectangle has a centroid of D by 2 so this Y1 will be equal to 6 divided by 2 equal to 3 cm. A2 is the area of this semicircle having a radius of 3 cm. So A2 will be equal to pi by 2 r square on substituting r equal to 3 cm we will get the value of A2 equal to 14.13 cm square. Now let Y2 be the centroidal distance of this area 2 from bottom line AB. This Y2 will be equal to 6 cm divided by 2 equal to 3 cm. A3 is the area of this triangle which will be equal to 6 cm into 6 cm divided by 2 equal to 18 centimeter square and let y3 be the centroidal distance of this area 3 from bottom line ab which will be equal to this 6 centimeter plus centroid of this triangle which will be equal to h by 3 equal to 6 by 3 so we will get the value of y3 equal to 8 centimeter now using the equation for y bar and substituting all the calculated values in this equation, we will get the value of y bar equal to 3.86 cm. Similarly, for calculating x bar, we will choose this line CD as a reference line. Let x1 be the centroidal distance of area 1, which will be equal to centroid of this rectangle equal to 12 cm divided by 2 plus this length 3 cm equal to 9 cm. And area 1 as calculated earlier is equal to 72 cm square. Let x2 be the centroidal distance of this area 2 which is a semicircle. So x2 will be equal to r minus 4r by 3 pi. And on substituting these values we will get x2 equal to 1.72 cm. This r minus 4r by 3 pi is the distance of uh, centroid of this semicircle from reference line CD. As we know centroid of a semicircle about its diameter is equal to 4r by 3 pi. So we will get the value of x2 by subtracting this uh, centroidal distance about its diameter from the radius of uh, this semicircle. And a2 as calculated earlier is equal to 14.13 cm square. Now let x3 be the centroidal distance of area 3 which will be equal to 3 cm plus 6 cm plus this 3 cm. Since this triangle is symmetrical about this axis so CG of this triangle will lie on the axis of symmetry and a3 as calculated earlier is equal to 18 cm square. Now using the equation for x bar and substituting all the values in this equation, we will get the value of x bar equal to 8.53 cm. So this was all for today. For much more informative and interesting content, subscribe my YouTube channel Civil Tutor and don't forget to press the bell icon so that you don't miss any updates in future. You can also follow me on Instagram and Facebook with the links given in description. We'll catch you up soon. Thank you.